Well, welcome back to Hannity. Earlier today, rallies were held at a California high school to protest a recent court ruling that prohibits students from wearing American flag apparel to school on Cinco de Mayo. The controversy dates back to this day in 2010, when several students wearing flag T-shirts were forced to take off the shirts or go home because it offended some of their Latino classmates. Here now to debate who's right and who's wrong. In this case, our Morgan Hill Patriots president, Georgine Scott Codiga, who attended the rally today. And also joining us is immigration attorney Francisco Hernandez. Okay, so let me start with uh, our, our immigration attorney. Uh, go ahead, make your case, sir. Oh, guys, why is it we cheer everyone when they ban the. Uh the use of the southern flag. It's, it, it's just, it, they're flags, guys. It is freedom of speech. What they did want to do is create or create a situation when there's going to be a confrontation. It had nothing to do with the flags. It had to do with Cinco de Mayo is a culturally Hispanic day. Uh, but quite frankly, what, what if they wore the French flags? I mean, guys, it's not about the flags. It's about the inciting a fight or inciting uncomfortableness. Let them have the, we can fly, fly the United States flag every other day of the, of, the, of the year. Why do we have to pick this time to make a point? We all have a right, freedom all right. of speech. It doesn't mean it's valuable. It's just your you right to make a jackass out of yourself. So let's just let them do it. Okay, Georgine, so the, the Supreme Court basically said students have, don't have the same free speech rights at school that, that adults don't? do. Uh, Georgine, you want to you weigh in on is this? You supreme, don't? Is the Supreme Court right or wrong we, in this? Sure. We think the Supreme Court's wrong because where in the Constitution is there a caveat that says accept? It says we all, you just said we all have a right. We all have a right. So we wanted to exercise our right 365 days a year. People died for that flag. Mm -hmm. to, and it's well, a positive we symbol. Did. Uh, hold on, we Fra did accept. Francisco, we have no Francisco, problem. Hold on, hold on. With Let me ask you this. Uh, it, given what we know now, so if you're a bully or if you have a problem with other uh, kids doing something at school, you can threaten them. And according to this ruling, if you, if you threaten them and the school believes it's a, a credible threat, you're going to make the people stop doing what they're doing that's ticking off the bully. No, it's just like the Fourth Amendment in school does not have the same protection. We do want the school to be able to search the students' lockers without probable cause. Why? Because there's a higher standard. There's children, there's drugs, there's guns. I don't see you arguing that they have to go get a warrant before searching a student's locker. And now you're complaining because they're banning the use of a certain flag. Schools no, 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 have a completely no, 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 sir, sir, sir. different that, that, standard than you saying. and I, I have I on this show. I agree with you it's that not there, a there, certain there, flag. There, there are there are certain standards that 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 are and standards in schools are different than they your privacy apply. rights elsewhere. I agree with that. Absolutely. My problem is, Georgine, is that this seems this ruling seems to promote anyone who's got a problem with anything getting their way because the Supreme Court says uh, if there's a perceived threat, the people no. who are doing it. Have to stop. No. Hold on. Let me get exactly. Georgine, please. Exactly. Exactly. If you can't control your emotions, <laughs> we're, we're going to ban it because you can't control your emotions. Since when is the American flag offensive? The American flag is a national symbol of freedom and unity and pride for American people. Why do we need to? Why do we need to ban that? So, so because you can't is, control and I your the emotions. the American flag so, in my office. So, so Francisco, let me ask you this. If some group felt that wearing, I don't know, the colors that, um, that represent being gay, if they felt that was offensive, and they said if those peoples continue to wear those rainbow colors because that promotes uh, a gay lifestyle, they're going to beat them up. The Supreme Court should be okay with the school set telling sure. the, the gay people not to wear those colors? You got it. You got it. The school has a, a right to set the rules for the school. And you and I agree that the school standard is completely different. Yes, absolutely. The schools ought to be able to instill the rules that they think is for the better of the students. Now, if we have a problem with the schools, we vote at the school board. I don't agree with a lot of the rules the school board do because they do a one size fits all. But yes, you're absolutely right. If they want to ban the gay rights flag, OK, if they want to ban the Mexican flag, Go for it if there's a reason for it, constitutional reason for it. But we have no problem with them searching our, our kids' lockers. You know what? I want them searching my kids' locker. But you can't say that one constitutional right is more valuable than another constitutional right. Actually, probably the Fourth Amendment is much more valuable than your right to free speech to make a jackass out of yourself. Georgine, you, do you want to take the other side? of That's a tough argument to take the yeah. other side of, though, by the way. Well, uh, under the Constitution, it says we have freedom from censorship. 
I didn't read anywhere in the Constitution where it says, except when someone like you chooses to change that. There's no exception. Our, our rights are given to us by God and guaranteed by that Constitution. So I don't <laughs> God see didn't where, give us where the you're getting the right to... He gave us the Ten Commandments, but we're talking about schools, not our constitutional rights. Georgie? You're, you're talking about your opinion because you don't like what no. we're saying. You want to censor us. We're the gonna have the to flag is not. The We're going to have to leave it there. This is going to be up for a lot more discussion, especially because the fact that it was a flag on the T-shirt that is really, really making people's heads uh, get a little crazy right now. All right.